Democrats announce new plan for ICE, their 2018 election chances take a sharp turn. We've been waiting for it and now it's here. The Democrats have just chose their destiny, and everything will become crystal clear soon. We saw it coming long ago. Even before Donald Trump threw his hat in the ring, the left overstepped their bounds with Barack Obama. The most liberal president in the United States went too far to shove progressive nonsense down America's throats. Many Americans woke up after the disaster that was Obamacare ruined their health care. It's only gotten worse since then. After their Titanic loss in 2016, the Democrats refused to reform. They pushed more and more to the left, alienating whoever was left that support them. Now, they've gone off the deep end. Their new idea exposes just how lawless and un-American they are. And how little they care about our citizens. From Fox News. The idea was once relegated to the far left. But the liberal push to abolish the federal agency that enforces federal immigration laws is going mainstream in the Democratic Party, with New York Senator Kirsten Gillibrand and Mayor Bill de Blasio adding their support to the cause in the last 24 hours. I believe that. Immigration and Customs Enforcement, has become a deportation force, and that's why I believe you should get rid of it, start over, reimagine it and build something that actually works, Gillibrand said in a CNN interview Thursday night. We should abolish ICE, de Blasio said Friday morning on WNYC Radio. Gillibrand's endorsement is notable as she's the first sitting senator to back the abolish ICE push and is considered a potential 2020 presidential contender. They join numerous other Democratic candidates, House members, liberal commentators and writers who have fought back against the Trump administration's immigration policies by calling to gut ICE, which identifies, arrests and deports illegal immigrants inside the United States. There you go. The Democrats have just destroyed their party to call for the eradication of a group that protects the United States from criminals is unthinkable. ICE prevents very dangerous people from entering the country. That includes drug cartel members and terrorists. Do Democrats really think that most Americans will support this idea? It's obvious they embraced this idea after Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez, a relative newcomer, won the Democratic primary in Queens. I guess these old-timers were afraid of losing their seats. But flocking to this hard-left idea is ridiculous, considering how many Americans are sick of the crisis at the border. Democrats think all the fake news trying to smear Trump is working. Except, Americans are more convinced we need a secure border. That includes an effective device that will capture and deport criminal aliens. No intelligent politician would think this is a good idea. Could there be a Judas goat in their midst? pushing Democrats to do stupider and stupider things? Very possible.